Hello and welcome to WePC. My name's Jack and today we've got some benchmarks for you. We're benchmarking the Ryzen 5 7600X against the Ryzen 5 5600X in both synthetic and real world benchmarks. On the synthetic agenda today is CPU-Z, Cinebench and Geekbench 5. Over in the games corner, we've got Battlefield 5, Cyberpunk 2077, Elden Ring, CSGO and GTA 5. So first off then in CPU-Z, the multicore benchmarks read 6,075.6 points for the 7600X. By comparison, the 5600X scores 4,881, a full 1,200 points behind the 7600X. On the single core side of things, the 7600X manages 766.4 points. When compared to the 5600X's score of 642 points, it's easy to see how this is the best performing 6 core CPU to date. Cinebench now. And the 7600X scored a massive 1,954 points in the single core benchmarks, compared to the 5600X which scored 1,527 points, trailing over 400 points behind. In multicore benchmarks, we see the Ryzen 5 7600X score 15,000 points, compared to the 5600X's 10,891. All in all, we see performance improvements of around 34% in Cinebench, which is pretty darn good. Geekbench then. Geekbench sees the 7600X score 2,183 points in the single core benchmarks and 11,120 points in the multi core benchmarks. This compared to the 5600X's 1,653 points and 8,583 points, respectively. On to the real world gaming benchmarks now. And the Ryzen 5 7600X does pretty well. We've paired this with the Asus ROG Crosshair Extreme X670 motherboard, 6000 MHz DDR5 RAM and the RTX 3080, just to make sure we're not shy on performance. The 7600X manages 193 FPS on average, while the 5600X only achieves 175 FPS. That's an improvement of around 8% for the 7600X. In Cyberpunk, the 7600X brought in 170 FPS, and the 5600X only offered 147 FPS on average. That's a performance improvement of about 14%. Elder Ring tells a similar story. The 7600X scores 157 FPS average, whilst the 5600X presents 143 FPS average. These results show performance improvement of around 9%. CSGO wielded the best results yet, showing the Ryzen 5 7600X pulling a blistering 378 FPS on average, and a 5000X falling behind with an average FPS of 352, all in all around a 7% performance increase. GTA 5 was a bit of a strange one. The 7600X brought home 187 FPS, however the 5600X scored an average FPS of 186. We either hit a GPU wall on GTA 5, which we see as very unlikely, or the game is no longer as CPU bound as we thought it was. So with all that then, we can see that the 7600X is a very formidable CPU, especially for gaming. Its multi-core and single-core improvements make it well worth the $299 you spend on it. This has been Jack from WePC, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.